Hi, I'm Sean, and I'm coming in hot with a topic that, I sa- that sounds intimidating, but I promise is very relatable. So I want you guys to remember three things for me. 3D printing, morphing, airplanes. Who's heard of 3D printing? It's pretty common in a cool technology that's called additive manufacturing because it builds things up instead of taking things away. Morphing. Morphing means shape changing, and ever since 1903, when airplanes came around, we've been modeling them after birds, and birds morph. They change the shape of their wings, and if we could do this on airplanes, they could get faster or better performance. But why don't we have this? It's because materials that airplanes are made of, like metal or composites, don't like to change their shape, and that's because to change your shape, you need to be strong and flexible, and materials that are strong don't like to be flexible, so even though airplanes are 100 years old, we still haven't seen morphing. The morphing I'm interested in, this is my wing and this is my flight control that when it moves creates a gap that if we could fix with a morphing structure, we could get improved aerodynamics. That means cheaper plane tickets if you like to travel or quieter airplanes if you live near an airport. So I think we can take multi-material 3D printing to take materials that are strong and materials that are flexible to get structures that are strong and flexible. This is really exciting because it could change all of aerospace, so whether you want to go to Mars or you want to fly in cheaper, quieter airplanes, this research benefits us all. So 3D printing, morphing airplanes. Thank you.